In singing programs, we've often heard this term, such and such methodology, this and that training, vocal technique methodology. It's, it's a popular buzzword. And um, I suppose TVS has a certain methodology, but before I go quickly into the details of what makes the TVS methodology, let me define for you what a methodology is and isn't. A vocal training methodology is not a, a folder full of media files dumped into it. A vocal training methodology is not a interesting, entertaining, helpful book with a lot of good ideas and training techniques in it. That's not a methodology. It might be helpful, might be great, but that's not a training methodology. In order for a training program to have a methodology, you have to have, I believe, two primary things. Number one, the ideas and the techniques inside the program have to be innovative, new, original, things that really haven't been expanded on and ever tried before, original ideas. The other thing that you need to transcend from a book of good ideas to a training methodology is process, systems, a way to teach and show students of training how to practice, how to train, how to put the ideas all together in a practical way so that you can practice it. When you have original ideas and a process for practicing, you have a methodology. Now, the TVS methodology is expanded on in more detail in the book in a bigger video, but right now, just to keep it simple, I'm gonna cut right to the chase and tell you what we do that people are excited about and are using to get great results every day around the world. Number one, TVS methodology holds a high value. It's an attitude. It's a value statement about the ability to bridge the vocal registers from the chest voice through the vocal break into the head voice without pushing, choking, breaking, and having instability issues with your voice. We call this bridging and connecting. The ability to bridge through the vocal break and once you're in your head voice, making your head voice sound huge and belty and boomy and convincing to the audience and not something that's ah, ah, windy and sounds unpowerful. Two, the other thing that characterizes TVS methodology is specialized onsets. Now, what's an onset? Onset just means the beginning, the start, okay? This is an onset. Me, that is a vocal onset. And in TVS, we make a big deal about onsets, the way you begin the training note or the singing note. In fact, we have eight specialized onsets, techniques that students train and teachers teach that help students isolate muscle and coordination to get stronger and more coordinated for singing. All right? So the onsets are used so that you can get stronger and work on individual muscles and issues inside this, the mechanism, the voice, the larynx to get stronger. The specialized onsets are also used by students and teachers to troubleshoot problems. If you're pushing too much on high notes, we might recommend a wind and release onset. If you need to get more compression on your vocal folds, we might recommend a quack and a release onset. If you wanna to learn to belt and pull your chest voice higher to sound more chesty on higher notes, we would work on dampen and release onsets as well as attack and release onsets. Again, these specialized onsets are expanded on in more detail in the product, but needless to say, onsets, the way you start a note is super important and is a, uh, a powerful thing that characterizes TVS methodology. In TVS, we're big on training, big on practicing. So we have developed training workflows. Training workflows, what does that mean? Training workflow is just simply step one, step two, step three, step four the sequential steps to any process. And when it comes to training your voice and getting stronger as a singer, if you really want to be efficient and get from point A to point B quickly and get the fastest progress in your training, having the TVS training workflows will go a long way to cut to the chase, um, not waste time and get you training on exactly what you need to be working on and not what you don't need to be working on. TVS methodology is characterized by vocal modes. TVS is a vocal mode pedagogy. What does that mean? 
Vocal modes are basically ways of categorizing certain configurations, physical and acoustic in the voice. It helps me as a teacher, you as a student, to understand what's going on in the singing voice by putting them into groups and logical categories. In TVS, we have two kinds of vocal modes. We have physical modes. Physical modes are unique physical or physiological configurations, the way the larynx is set up, the vocal folds, the, the, uh, the embouchure, the mouth, the way the physical elements of your singing voice are set up are physical modes. There's eight of them in TVS. Um, for example, what I'm doing right now is one of the eight physical modes. It's called speech mode. The way my voice is set up right now is characteristic of speech mode. And you can learn more about the other speech modes, some of them absolutely critical to singing in the program. Um, by the way, speech mode would not be a mode that helps you much for singing. Helps you for talking and, and uh, doing, a, doing a presentation to a camera, but not for singing. So with the TVS methodology, learn the other exotic physical modes and you'll learn more about what a great singing voice requires. The other vocal mode group that we have is called acoustic modes. So we have the physical group and we have the acoustic modes, which addresses the acoustics of singing, formant tuning, vowels, singing vowels, um, the acoustics of singing and understanding how the acoustics of singing works is absolutely mission critical to singing great. Understanding vowels, and when I say vowels, not speech vowels, not linear speech vowels, but singing vowels. Mastering singing vowels helps you to master the acoustics of singing. And if your acoustics of singing is balanced and aligned and your formant is tuned, then the physiology, the physical mode elements will work for you. The end result is you're able to bridge and connect from your chest voice through the vocal break to your head voice and sound great and make the audience excited to hear you sing. And last but not least, similar to bridging and connecting, the vocalist studio and the four pillars of singing is very big on training content. Content that helps you as the student of vocal training practice and know what to do. In the industry of vocal training products and programs, I find it interesting to discover that many of my colleagues who are offering similar services, and by the way, I'll preface this by saying are great and talented and have inspired me in some ways, but there's something that's very interesting that is missing. There's no training content, scales, workouts, so that when you, the student, when you're ready to put a microphone in your hand, and you want to work out and train to get a stronger voice for your singing, it's not there. So the TVS methodology is not only a great book with ideas and techniques and onsets and training workflows and acoustic modes and physical modes and these things, but at the end of the program, we have over a hundred pages of training routines that show you how to bring it all together so that you can actually practice the content. In that way, the four pillars of singing is like the P90X of vocal training products for singers. So that is a quick overview of what is the TVS methodology. And I can tell you this, and from the bottom of my heart, I'm not trying to give you a marketing pitch. I'm just giving you important information. If you train these TBS methodology ideas and put it all together in the content I was just referring to, you will get stronger and you will learn to bridge your vocal registers seamlessly, smoothly, no pushing, no breaking, no yodeling, no quacking like a choking duck in your head voice. The entire voice with patience, discipline, and a lot of training in this, in this program and these, these techniques will help you to sing the way you have always dreamed to be able to sing. And it's my job 
and the job of the TVS certified instructor is to help you get there and guide you on that path. And I'm excited to begin that journey with you.